Good morning, everyone. My name is Daniel Pello. I'm coming to you here from First Presbyterian Church in Covington, Virginia. I'd like to start out this morning with a scripture reading from Luke chapter 12, verses 49 through 59. I came to bring fire to the earth, and how I wish it were already kindled. I have a baptism with which to be baptized, and what stress I am under until it is completed. Do you think that I have come to bring peace to the earth? No, I tell you, but rather division. From now on, five in one household will be divided, three against two and two against three. They will be divided, father against son and son against father, mother against daughter and daughter against mother, mother mother-in-law against her daughter-in-law and daughter-in-law against mother-in-law. He also said to the crowds, When you see a cloud rising in the west, you immediately say, It is going to rain. And so it happens. And when you see the south wind blowing, you say, There will be scorching heat. And it happens. You hypocrites, you know how to interpret the appearance of earth and sky, but why do you not know how to interpret the present time? And why do you not judge for yourselves what is right? Thus, when you go with your accuser before a magistrate, on the way make an effort to settle the case. Or you may be dragged before the judge, and the judge hand you over to the officer, and the officer throw you in prison. I tell you, you will never get out until you have paid the very last penny. Please join me, please join me now in a time of prayer now together. Dear Lord, our Heavenly Father, thank you for fearfully and wonderfully creating each of us so uniquely, all of your children. Thank you for giving us worth in your eyes. Help us to live as the one that you uniquely intended us to be. Help us abide instead of strive, living peacefully and joyfully as heirs to your kingdom and co-heirs with Christ. And when life is hard and we may not know what to do, help us to remember that you are with us and that we are never alone. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you all for joining me here this morning. Hope to see you right here tomorrow at 8 a.m. I hope you all have a good day today.